Hi, my name's Amy and I'm from the Hobbycraft Hub. Today I'm going to show you how to make Easter bunny cookies. For this project you will need a bunny cookie cutter, a recipe for cookie dough, black food colouring paste, edible glue, a piping bag and writing nozzle, roll out icing in pink and white, a rolling pin and some icing sugar. To begin with you need to make your cookie dough recipe according to the instructions that you have to make your bunny face shapes and then bake according to your recipe. Open your icing and then I'm going to take a pinch off and roll it into a little ball for the centre of the face and the same with the other one and just pop them down to see where they'll sit and squash them a little bit into ovals like that. And then we're going to take our edible glue. So this enables you to stick icing onto non-icing surfaces like biscuits that might be a bit dry. Paint the back of it with the glue, nice and thick, and then pop it on where you want it to go on your cookie. It doesn't dry instantly, so you can move it around a little bit if you want to. Just make sure they're in the middle of this cheek area. Next, you need to roll out a bit of white icing to use on the ears. You want to make the little inserts for the ears. So take a nice sharp knife and cut the inner ear shape out of your icing. And then remove them. And then you can neaten up any edges just by squashing them down a little bit with your fingers. Now you want to attach it to your bunny biscuit, same as we did with the cheeks. So I'm just gonna place them where I want them to check size and stick them on. So next you want to do the bunny's nose. Roll it into a little ball and then you're going to make a little triangle shape for the nose. You can do this just with your thumb and your forefinger. Now the bunny doesn't have any eyes, so that's what's coming next. Just cut some little circles for the eyes. And I'm going to stick them down with the edible glue again. So now you need to add the detail to your bunny's face. So we're going to use black icing that I've already mixed up. This is just a mix of icing sugar, water and black food colouring. So I'm going to start with the eyes, just a little blob in the centre of each. Don't worry if it looks a bit spiky, it will settle itself. And then we're going to do the whiskers. It's up to you how many whiskers you want. And then you can also add a few little dots on his cheeks if you want. And there's your finished bunny. You just need to let the icing set, give it an hour or so, and they're ready to eat. For more information on the products you've seen today, go to the website, the blog, or pop into your local store and speak to one of our colleagues.